What's poppin' art right, fam? Art right, ball checking in here. And today we have a lot to discuss. Now let's jump right into it. First off, salute notification game. Hitting that like button for the video to start. Y'all the real art right, fam. Salute. Anyway, up first, we got that boy Young Dolph. Okay, so we all know what's been going on with that boy Young Dolph. He been in a roller coaster situation, fam. First, he already got that beef going with that boy Yo got it. He just took the Twitter the other day to go at that boy, yo, got it. Hey, man, I fuck your baby mom. Deal with it, bro. Stop being a soul loser. Get over it, fam. Then he got that situation going on with Black Youngster. You little, little, little bit of horse bitch. Well, he was allegedly involved in that shooting that happened at that boy, Young Dolph, at CIAA, fam. And that boy dropped a diss song towards Young Dolph as well, bro. Claiming that that boy, Young Dolph, out here snitching, fam. Now, a few moments later after that disc was dropped, that boy Rollo took the IG story and said, you know, damn well, my boy Young Dolph ain't never been no rat. Now, we all know that boy Rollo spoke out against that boy Black Youngster about that shy glizzy situation, fam. He said he had no business putting it out there in public that he was getting the chain back, bro. He said real niggas moving silent, fam. But he also spoke with Master Peel last month where he said it's no beef between him and Yo Gotti and that boy Black Youngster. He said he was just speaking his mind. So I guess he just speaking his mind in this situation as well, bro. Now, Young Dolph finally spoke out for the first time since that Black Youngster situation happened where he got jammed up, fam, for allegedly being involved in that shooting. Now, Young Dolph had an interview with 92.3 The Beat where he spoke on several things, bro. First, they asked him, how it feels to be Young Dolph. He said, it's good. I feel good being a self-made man. Now, doing this all independently, bro. Then they went on to ask about that boy, Yo Gotti. He said, ain't no situation with Yo Gotti. He said he never respected him, but that play with your bitch go hard in the club, bro. Then he went on to brag a little more about how play with your bitch is the hardest thing in the club, bro. Then they asked him finally about the CIAA shoe fam. They ask him first, they said, did you really spend $300,000 on bulletproof cars? He said, shit, I spent more than that on bulletproof cars. Then they said, what about the attempt on your life? He said, man, I don't even want to speak about that situation in Charlotte no more. Then they ask him about Black Youngster. What do you think about him supposedly being involved? He paused. He said, I ain't got nothing to do with it and I don't give a damn about it. I really don't give a damn about it. That boy Young Dolph refusing to speak on that situation, period, bro. Now, honestly, I think it was a smart move by him to do that because you already got people out here talking about this man snitching, bro. So any little thing he would have said about the situation, that would have added more fuel to the fire. And plus, you know the feds are sitting back watching, fam. Honestly, bro. I never really heard Young Dolph say anything too crazy about Black Youngster fam. He goes straight to the head of the snake, which is Yo Got It, bro. Now, of course, you got some people saying, oh, he only do that because, you know, Black Youngster really with the shits. But it's what y'all think. Y'all comment down below. What do you think about this entire situation? Also, comment down below. What do you think that boy Young Dolph should do from here? Anyway, I'm about to be out of here. Sub to the channel if you haven't. Press that sub button. Also, press that bell beside it. So you get notification anytime I drop a video. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description. Follow me on IG at Related Ball Ball. Salute to y'all, man. We on that 100K grind. Up ball. Go.